Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video we're going to learn how to knit the strawberry stitch and I've seen this stitch on Pinterest on multiple of beautiful sweaters, chunky big sweaters with um, like bobbly sleeves and plain stockinette bodies and I have here I designed a raglan top-down cardigan featuring this beautiful stitch for the sleeves. This is a children like girls cardigan and I have a video coming up on it but um, in the meantime I wanted to show you how to work the stitch in case you wanted to use it for a blanket or for a scarf or maybe even for a hat. Um, now I'm going to show you how to knit this in the flat and if you're interested to learn to knit it in the round then let me know and I can film a video on that as well. So you want to cast on a multiple of 6 plus 2. So I have here 14 stitches, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 14 stitches and we're going to begin to work this stitch. So we're going to start with purl 2 then I'm going to knit one, purl two again, okay and now in the next stitch we're going to make five stitches. So I'm going to go in and knit one, keep the stitch on the needle, yarn over, go in again, knit another one, keep it on a needle, yarn over, in again and knit another. So we created five stitches in one. Then we're going to repeat the same um, stitches again. Purl two, knit one, purl two, and in the next stitch we're going to make five. So I'm going to go in, knit one stitch, yarn over, in the same stitch again, knit, yarn over, in the same stitch again, knit. And then I'm going to purl two. Alright, that's the first row. Now for the next row, um, we are going to start with knit nine. So I'm going to knit nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then I'm going to purl one and it's a purl stitch, you'll, you'll know. Then I'm going to knit nine again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then we get to a purl, so I'm going to purl that and then we're going to knit two. So that's row number two. Then we're going to work row number three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Knit the knits and purl the pearls. So just plain knit the knits and purl the pearls. So we have here two pearls. I'm going to purl, purl one, purl two. Then I'm going to knit. Then I'm going to purl.
Okay. Oh. So now row nine is another action row. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to work it. Oh, sorry about that. So we're going to start by purl two. Then in this knit stitch, we're going to make five. So exactly like we did down here, we're going to make five here. So I'm going to go in, knit, keep the yarn in, uh, keep the stitch on, yarn over, go in and knit again, yarn over, go in and knit again. So five stitches in one. Then we're going to purl two. Then we're going to knit, oh, knit five together. So this is quite challenging. Um, if you're a very tight knitter, this is going to be a really big challenge. But all you got to do is go through the follow the next five stitches, and I knit them through the back loop. So just pull your needle in, grab your yarn, and pull through. So that's five stitches, turn into one. Then we're going to pull two, and again. From this knit stitch, we're going to make five. So go in, knit, yarn over, in again, knit, yarn over, in again, knit. And take it off the needle. Then we're going to pull two. And we're going to knit five together again. So we're going to put our right needle through all five stitches. Make sure you grab them all five. Okay. Grab your yarn and pull through. Oops, split this, the yarn. So we knitted five together. Then I'm going to pull two. Okay, so that's another action row, and that's what makes the bobbles, as you can see. Then we're going to turn our work and we're going to knit two. Then that knit five together, we're going to purl it and we're going to knit two again and this is the make five, so we're going to knit through all stitches, so knit five and we have two more stitches here to knit, so we're going to knit two more, so it's knit nine there, I'm going to purl this one and knit nine again. Okay, so the next six rows, we're just going to do the same, knit the knits and purl the pearls, and then um, that's the row repeat. So let me speed up to there and show you what it looks like. Okay, so we're ready here for um, another action row, which is almost like the first row when we started, it just has a little, a little twist. So um, instead of that knit one that we did at the beginning, we're just going to make five there. So we're going to start with purl two. Then I'm going to knit five together. Okay, purl two, and here we're going to make five, like we did in the first one. So, knit, yarn over, knit, yarn over, knit in the same stitch, then repeat. Purl two, knit five, together. Ooh. Pull two and make five. Knit one, yarn over, knit another, yarn over, knit another, 
in the same stitch and then purl two. Here we go. So now you're just going to go back to row number two and repeat that until you get to this one. And this is what it looks like. And um, I want to show you a trick because um, as you can see, the, the, the knit stitches are always um, kind of like the tail of the strawberry. And then the M5 are the strawberries and then the knit five together is the tip of the strawberry. And then always from the tip of the strawberry, you start another tail until you start a new strawberry. And then when you finish the strawberry, like I finished the strawberry here, you start another tail. And just that's how it keeps going. And I think it's a pretty, pretty stitch and I like it. And I can't wait for um, you to see the new pattern that's coming up with the with this stitch but yeah if you want to work this stitch then um, I will put uh, row by row in the description down below and also links to my Ravelry so you keep an eye when my pattern comes out but yeah thanks for watching and I will see you in my next one bye